of the book is Sugar. Sugar. She's one of the biggest names in the adult film industry. She's doing other things besides, you know, movies. She's got a book out. Jenna Jameson, welcome to Good Day New York. How Hi. are you? Hi. Thanks for having me. When did you retire from adult films, or have you fully retired? About 10 years ago. 10 years ago. But yeah. the body of work, obviously, is still out there, and people still watch. Of course. So now you've been writing this this novel, right? It's it's described yes, as an erotic novel. Yes, it's a trilogy. Novel. Oh, it's a trilogy. Yeah. And are you? Is there something about the main character that is kind of um, similar to your life? It's about me. It is about you. It's about me. So tell us a, the story. Well, I mean, I I didn't want it to be exact of what I've always done. So I so I kind of made up a. a fantastic yummy story because I you know I read all the other stories and I was like Ugh. have you read Fifty Shades of Grey yes and what, what is this like this has a little bit more to it it does it does a right. huge amount more hmm. interesting I think it's gonna do very well your previous book did very well as well can I ask you this how did you first get into uh, the adult film business what that that first leap has got to be a big one uh, I was very young. How old were you? I, I, 19. Did somebody, uh, did you want to do it? Did somebody push you into it? No. I, I just figured it would be fun. <laughs> and and was it? It was you know, fun. Did you see that movie Lovelace that came out this year, Bella, the yeah, Lovelace? Yeah, I was kind of sad. Because that, that was different, because it seemed like she did not want to get in, involved with the industry, and, and they were a little abusive to her. Were they abusive yeah, I, to you? I, listen, whatever she had to say, I seem to think that it was bull. You weren't, you, you weren't buying her story? No. So the adult film industry was, was good to you, and you enjoyed it? Yeah, I made my, my whole entire life was taken care of. I did it. And, and you made a lot of money, yeah. right? Yes. Can I ask you this? I've always kind of been curious. I mean, when, you, when you're in that industry, is it possible to have a regular marriage? I know you've been married. I mean, mm -hmm. with when you in, it's a unique line of work, and you meet these other people, and you're intimate with them. Is it possible to be intimate with one person at the same time? You know what I mean? Well, I was always really good at being monogamous. I, I like When that. you weren't working? No, while I was working. It, it, I mean, I would love to be just with him, mm -hmm. so. Sure. Can we talk about uh, your marriage right now? Obviously things are going crazy. You've been tweeting about your, your ex, Tito, and, and, um, and your kids. How, how is that going right now? Has he responded to you at all? Uh, no, everything's going well. <laughs> it's going well. Um, yeah, everything's going to go okay. Well, listen, Jenna Jameson, it's nice meeting you. We wish you all the best. And uh, uh, personally, I'm glad that you kind of moved on from the industry. Not passing judgment or anything like that, but I'm glad. And I hope uh, I hope uh, things settle down okay. with whatever Rosanna was and talking about. And we want to talk about uh, book signing tomorrow at 12 noon, Barnes & Noble, Fifth Avenue. If you yes. want to meet Jenna Jameson tomorrow, Barnes & Noble, 12 noon. Thank you, We're Jenna. We're going to have so much fun. All right. Good luck, ah. Good luck, Jenna. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Mike Woods. All right. Let's show you what's going on out there today.